Peter Chow's brand new shirt, Dim Sum Love, is now available via Panic Pop at bit.ly slash Dim Sum Love. The shirt expresses Peter Chow's and surely every other Asian on the motherfucking planet's view on delicious Dim Sum. So if you rough Dim Sum like Peter Chow does, show your fucking rough. Bit.ly slash Dim Sum Love. That's bit.ly slash Dim Sum Love. Excuse me, my goodness, did you hear that raspiness in my voice? I sound like a 78-year-old man who has just gone for a stroke. And you know what? Strokes aren't funny. My grandma had a stroke. My grandpa had a stroke. Oh, jeez, it runs in the child family. But mostly, uh, we would have to be probably due to the fact that they loved the greasy-ass Chinese food when they were younger. Uh, so hopefully, if I just watch my Thai in, and I'm not talking about Thai, Thai is a bad word. Uh, Thai is just a, the worst word in the world. But if I watch out uh, what I eat, and I maintain a very, very nutritious, well balanced, uh, I'm going to say Thai again. Fuck, fuck me. Oh God. Uh, but anyway, we are down to the litty gritty. It is almost Valentine's Day. What should I get the mother bitch? Oh my goodness, the thing is, is that every year Valentine's Day comes around, you have to think. And there's one thing that I hate doing, is thinking. I like the doing part, I just don't like the thinking. And thinking it requires the use of the mind. So I need your guys' help. You know, what should I get? Should I get her a teddy bear? Should I get her the uh, teddy bear? Uh, or should I get her the teddy bear? I don't know, I don't know which teddy bear should I get? Uh, but uh, more importantly, I mean, I will come to a decision on my own. You guys, you know, feel free to suggest. But I'm probably not even going to take your suggestions into consideration because it's going to be childish. It's going to be like, give her a romp in the romp, romp, romp. And put your wiener here, put your wiener there. You know, that's not really a gift. Uh, you know, you guys, uh, you know, you're not very, be, being very mature. Any, any comment that has anything to do with put your wiener here or there, you know, it's just, I mean, I'm not going to take that into consideration. I apologize for the external noise that you are probably hearing right now. It is the heat because right now I'm in Canada, even though I'm in the West Coast, it's cold as fuck over here as well. It's definitely not LA weather. So keep in mind, I'm going to turn it off a little bit. Okay, there we go. Do you hear me better? Do you hear me better? Kesha's in the background. Oh wait, that's not Kesha. Uh, but uh, what I do want to talk to you about, uh, about this is that I, I, I'm i looking to be a little bit more collaborative with my fan base. Uh, so that's all of you in the child nation. Now, I don't know how many of you have Skype or you want to contact me directly, but here's the thing. I'm going to contact about 10 of you uh, people in the Chow Nation tomorrow. That would make it a Sunday. And what I'm going to ask you, I'm going to ask you a series of questions on who you think is hot and who you think is not. So if I say, for example, Scarlett Johanna Moranson, you go hot or not? You know what I'm talking about? So you just have to tell me if somebody that I ask you hot or not, you say hot and then I say not, or you say not, I say hot, you know? And we just get into a discussion. And then you are going to make it into my main channel video. So essentially, it's a sell out. Uh, what I want you to do, all of you, no question. Uh, sorry about that sun blaring into your eyes right now. But uh, I want you to leave, if you're comfortable with leaving your information, I want you to leave your Skype in the comment section below. And what I'm going to do tomorrow is I'm going to call 10 of you at random. So if you leave your Skype in the underpenny section, comment below, I will call you tomorrow at some point. Um, now, obviously, I'm going to probably contact 10 of you only. Hold on! My goodness, I'm trying to drive and vlog at the same time. Anyhow. Yeah, leave your Skype in the underpenny section below and I will contact 10 of you tomorrow for a channel uh, for, to have you on my main channel. So if you want to participate in a then you leave your Skype in the underpenny section below. I will call you tomorrow and that is the end of that and then you are going to be in my main channel video sometime next week.
Okay, so do that for me right now. The Dim Sum Love, of course, is available at bit.ly slash Dim Sum Love. Record setting sales last week, so I want to keep that up. Uh, Dim Sum Love, I guess a lot of people love Dim Sum. Don't be the only motherfucker in the Chow Nation without a Dim Sum Love shirt. Get it today! And if you get it, that's another way to get a shout out. So I'm just trying to communicate with my fan base a little better. So leave your Skype in the other penny section below. I will call 10 of you tomorrow. And I will stop repeating myself. Until next time, ciao outside, motherfucker. Hey guys, I have a brand new show called Wedding Treasures where a boatload of comedians and I watch amateur wedding videos and we laugh at them. I personally appear in episodes 1, 4, 5, and 7 but feel free to watch them all. If you're on a mobile device, the link will be in the description. Bobby you row. And joy. Awesome. I'd just like to say thank you for everybody for coming. Very awesome you put this on. Awesome. Does this guy know any other word except for the word awesome? It's like the Bachelorette, where the only word they know is amazing. That's amazing. F***ing idiots. Rock the shades that Peter Chow wears today by visiting ShadySluts.com. Shades are only $34, and when you use my personal promo code, PyroBoobs, you will get $10 off. ShadySluts.com.